everyone and welcome to Pixel Ponies Acreage. I'm not 100% sure if that is the name I'm going to go with, but for right now, that is what is happening so yeah <laughs> we are very close to bringing the horses here but before we did that i thought i would come down to the barn which has recently been finished being built or basically finished i'll talk about that a little bit later and get ready for the horses we've got a little bit of furniture to add in we also have to put some shavings down to make sure the horses are going to be super duper comfortable when they are brought in in the next video which should be next week so i think i've got a lot of work ahead of me with furnishing this place so let's get started shall we so this video isn't particularly anything about the horses or even a barn tour it's kind of a little sneak peek i don't really know why i decided to do this video anyways we are here and currently i am decorating the little sitting area if you were on the live stream when i first started building this area this barn i didn't want to immediately walk into horse stables and horsey stuff i wanted like an entrance area so this is the entrance area this here is going to be a little trophy stand and um yeah so currently obviously we don't have any trophies to put there but yeah i just want to kind of like have a little trophy case and literally i didn't really plan any of these design things oh by the way this is the mr crayfish furniture mod or something i am working on my website which will have like all of the mods that i use in my game but um yeah so this was very spur in the moment hopefully that looks good kind of thing but the final like look of the entire barn is going to be in the tour video which which is going to be in a couple of weeks from now we're also going to be decorating for christmas which i'm really excited for so that's a little sneak peek into the swim things also sorry i was flying i was too lazy i'm sorry i wanted to make it all realistic oh sorry this is out of role play oh my gosh who am i <laughs> The other side of the entrance area is the desk. So it's like an office administration area or something, which honestly, I probably need to get another mod to like decorate it a little bit nicer, but there's a desk and there is a painting, which I do end up moving over. You guys don't see it in this video. Once again, two are coming soon. There's also fairy lights like all over the place because fairy lights are pretty. What can I say? I don't know. <laughs> but um, yeah, there's also like a little windowsill with a plant and and I don't know, I kind of like it. It's kind of, it's kind of cute. And I hope to do a little bit more like role play lore decorations in the future. <laughs> Moving along at the back of this barn here, I wanted to add a little um, feed area. So yeah, this is the food area. There is buckets of food which don't currently have food in them. There's also a little whiteboard up there. Unfortunately, I can't actually put writings on it. There's probably a way to get custom paintings in Minecraft, but I kind of envisioned that's where like the writing of the horses and what food measurements they need would be. There is also a kitchen. This this isn't for like human use this is like for horses um see this sucks i like haven't been to an actual proper like public barn in ages the barns that i've been to have been like family owned kind of things so they're kind of like small and casual so i don't know like whether this kitchen is even realistic but moving along in this actually actual oh my gosh barn we do have a small tack area there is actually a tack room so there's just some extra halters here and maybe we'll chuck some more food bins in here in the future Speaking of tack room, here it is. This, I literally once again just randomly chucked things up onto the like bridle hangers what are they called and the saddle racks so we're not particularly going to be a western barn but for some reason I have a lot of western saddles around here. <laughs> Here 
Here we are in the lofted area of the barn. Now I thought about where I wanted to keep the food, like the hay bales, I suppose, for ages because I know that lofted barns aren't always the best option in um you know they, they always need to make sure that it's dry up there and it can be dangerous if a fire does start etc so this is probably temporary i do kind of think that i want to move the hay bales down to like an outside little area there is also i put some shavings up here because i thought i don't know people never talk about where you keep your horse shavings i suppose they are in like a bag so there is also barrels which will have the bags in them but also just some shavings on the ground Th that's probably like not realistic anyways i'm sorry <laughs> Here I am like unpacking the jump kind of section. This is like a little jumping shed, I'm going to be honest. This is probably definitely going to be changed. It looks kind of pretty bad right now. Um, when I actually set up some jumping, uh, what are they called, courses in the arenas. We do have three arenas currently. So um, yeah, currently I haven't figured out any jumping courses, any jump designs or anything like that. So this is definitely going to be changed. It's just kind of like the vibe right now, you know? Also very much out of, I I've talked about mods. I was trying to take this in a realistic route. You know what, I'm just talking. Anyways, I want to find a mod. I believe there's a mod where you can actually choose something and it like, will cycle through different designs without me having to build it every single time that probably made no sense but basically i want to find a mod which will make jumping courses easier if you know what i'm talking about please let me know in the comments below This is the actual like chill house. There is an actual kitchen. You guys can see the microwave in the corner. There is like a little TV, a chilling area. There's also a little like loft once again up the top, which is like open down anyways. You guys will see it in a tour, but I think that would be fun to have like little sleepovers in the future. Maybe, I don't know, saddle club vibes. Oh my gosh. But this is definitely not finished being furnished yet. I just am really bad at furnishing places. I don't furniture a lot in Minecraft, I suppose. The final thing that I needed to set up before the horses get here is the stalls. So I'm not actually going to show you guys the uh, preparing of every single stall because I don't want you guys to know how many horses we are bringing in for our first round of horses, I suppose. So yeah, this is a mixture of medium and dark shavings. And also we didn't put any food in the hay area or water yet because I want them to be completely fresh the day that the horses come. So yeah, you will see me decorate only two of the stools, but this was a little sneak peek into the stable. I'm very excited to share my plans with this barn, but also very nervous because as you guys can probably tell, I am not a horse in real life person. So it is so difficult for me to like do this because I just really want to make it as realistic as possible. And it's just really hard for me when I don't ride in real life. But um, yeah. Alright my friends, that is the end of today's video. I know it was probably kind of weird because there wasn't any horses and it wasn't even like a tour or anything, but maybe it's like creating hype for you guys, you know, like swim is kind of really fun and i've been super busy so i haven't really played swim because i've been playing pinecraft equestrian but i'm super duper excited to like ride the horses and do some more training and kind of like look i said before i'm not very good at like horsey stuff like i freak out too much i don't really like 
no like 100 percent realistically i do like so much research on my roleplay videos to try and make them super realistic but it's just it's so much information for my little brain but um I do have a little bit of like a story lore, not really lore, just like kind of like a little story, fun things, which also includes your involvement and like kind of your horses. I don't know. I'm really, I'm really excited. So um, yeah, I hope you guys are as excited as I am. If you don't know what swim is or you haven't seen this video, then on the screen right now is my first time ever playing swim in Minecraft. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm really excited. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for the support on that video, by the way. And um, yeah, bye.